Sup guys, welcome back to my channel and today it's another day of tutorial. Today we will talk about how you're going to fix the black screen on your OBS studio in three possible way. So please stay tuned and I'll show you how. Sup guys, welcome back to another day of tutorial. As I have said early, I will teach you how to fix the black screen on your OBS. First, I'll show you how it's look when it's working. It looks like this. And I'll show you later the black screen which is not working. So guys, I will bring you to the OBS screen which is not working. It really looks like this one. But first, we will try if it's working or no. First, you have to go to the scene. There is already a preset of scene 1. We, uh, then the next is you have to press OK because there is a scene 2 and that's uh, automatic display. So if you, if you want to rename that one, you can do. So press OK. Then the plus sign on these uh, sources. And go to display capture. Display capture guys and hit OK. Again, press OK. As you can see guys, there is a red, uh, red dot on the left upper corner. Actually, the normally if you click this one and uh, right click on your uh, mouse and transform, fit to screen it should be working but as you can see guys it's not working so we'll try another way how to fix this one one simple way to fix this one guys is just right click your mouse go to nvidia control panel I'll make this full screen. As you can see, guys, there's a manage 3D settings. Leave this one as it is. Just go to program settings. As you can see guys the program uh, the obvious program is already inside so this is okay but if it's uh, if, you can, if you couldn't find the program here you can search it from here add and you can add it from here and add selected program the next thing you have to do guys is to check the graphics which is uh, there are like two graphics installed in your computer so for this uh, for this one we have to click the integrated graphics and hit apply wait for a moment a few moments later Close this one. Check your OBS if it's working or no. Still, it's not working. That's, that, uh, that is the first tip which is I showed you. Now we'll go to the second step. Let's go to the start button. Go to OBS Studio 64 bit. Right click on this one. More. Op open file location. As you can see guys, uh, some of the problems, it, uh, some of the laptop have been upgraded to Windows 10. Then it happens sometimes. So, as you can see, there is an OBS Studio 64 bit. Just right click on this one. 
and go to property so you can see guys there's a general shortcut compatibility we have we, we will go to compatibility compatibility wow. ah. first I have to check this one compatibility mode if it's checked see normally if it's not working on 8 try to put seven, Windows 7 so hit ok apply ok and go back to your OBS to check if it's working still not working so that is the second step now we have to go to the third step which is a little bit tricky guys but you have please stay with us please stay with me sorry I'm alone this type uh, device manager it's a little bit uh, technical device manager as you can see it's an upper control panel panel device manager normally guys the laptops if like a been upgrade there are like two graphics card installed on your laptop so the, the good thing you have the first thing you have to do is to disable the first one which do you think is the better one you keep it uh, keep it running and the uh, low graphics uh, just disable that one as you can see guys this graphic Intel HD is 4000 and this is NVIDIA GeForce is GT 360M so I think this is lesser than this other one so I, I will try to Disable this NVIDIA GeForce. Yes. So now it's disabled. We'll check the OBS again. As you can see guys, now it's working. See, it's really easy, but you have to go through step by step. This now it's working, guys. So that's it. It's very simple. But you have to go. You have to be very patient doing this one, guys, because it's really, really tricky a little bit. And if you find it helpful, guys, please uh, put a thumbs up and uh, please like and subscribe. Subscribe for another tutorial. Thank you.